Welcome back everybody to Funky Star TV. Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, depending on your location. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, this is another mind-blowing news coming from Imo State. And this news consigned Governor Hope Zadema. We all know that any time they caught any politician red-handed, they always come out to deny the allegations. Now, this particular news when one air concerning Hope Zadema, uh, we are not here to claim uh, either it is true or it is false. So we are just here to analyze issues happening so that at least people can learn and also see things when they happen in our country and the people can also understand by the group of leaders when we see that them they bring set back to our nation when be nigeria because a lot of things we see here in the news happening in nigeria majority of them not they make any sense but ladies and gentlemen make i take all of us go through waiting that they tell us about who puts on them uh, Again, the governor of Imo State consigning pipeline to U.S. and Europe. Like I said before, remember, a politician will not come out and tell you that it is him that committed anything crime or fraud or looting. They will not come out and say so. They always deny. Even though see, you see them one-on-one -on -one stealing or looting looting fund they will also also deny it that no it is not me it is the other one or it is the other person now this particular issue the emo state government don't they come at now they come blame in the video when they make crown consigning this allegation against opposite them and say now ipob people say now them that is the pro agitators people won't be saying they support the agitation of uh, you know a free biafra okay make we take a look make it not be like say we they make things up the headline emo government debunks video linking who pose of them to gas pipe pipeline to us europe and other countries then they tell us say the emo state government say they don't come upon distance themselves from a trending video linking Hope Ozodema to an alleged pipeline being built in the state to connect gas directly to the United States of America and parts of Europe. This is huge. This is huge, ladies and gentlemen. This is huge. We continue. The government, through the Commissioner for Information, Public Orientation and Strategy, Emelumba, said the video purported to be issued by a pro Biafran organization was intended to smear the image of the governor and incite the group against the rest of nigeria the man come dismiss the video as a satanic attempt to incite another round of violence in the state after the recent burning of the national open university of nigeria center at iyemi mbano which was also foiled by unfounded rumors and incitement by the based and the range elements, he said. They have started again after the assault at Mbano. They have started weaving another web of lies and propaganda as a prelude to unleash violence in the state. The security agencies should be aware of the satanic move. He raised the alarm that the senseless, childish, and illogical contents of the video 
might be believed by gullible people with mob mentality to cause violence. He also explained that neither the federal government of Nigeria nor the states is aware of any plan to construct a pipeline from Imo State to either Europe or US. In their ignorance and haste to in their ignorance and haste to characterize Opozodema as a valiant, the purveyors of the hate speeches did not even consider the fact that such a project is practically impossible. So, ladies and gentlemen, this one now for the whole post of the man. What do you tell us? Say, you get one pipeline. Hmm? When the one link, I be the don't link come enter America and Europe. What do you think they take the, or when they want to take the sell out Nigerian people once again? Remember, all these things no go rich, opposed of them are do. All these things no go rich, all the whole governors when they Nigeria do. That is a smart thing to them because they are all criminals. They are all criminals and lawless individuals. People, when you did TC, not them be your president and governors and your leaders. They are criminal elements. That one, no go rich, opposed of them are do. Hmm? Somebody will be saying no win election since uh, he first do his four years. Now again, the man don't still sit down to do another four years without a proper voting. Without a proper election, the man is still there. So if the man, the man did there over how many years now, and nobody say a word, nobody challenge the man. Why you feel say who puts on them man who feel do this kind of thing when they allege against him? So, in she say nobody challenge her. Nobody can challenge him in that particular position. That is why you have the gods to do that. You have that power. You know, nothing they happen. I'm going to do this thing. Nobody's going to make noise. I'm going to continue to make my money. In a mafia, in a mafia style, and we continue until this thing now is exposed. So uh, we are just analyzing, ladies and gentlemen. We don't know if it is who puts on them or if it is other people that are planning it or that they have done it. So, but the news says so. Okay, the news says so. But remember, any time you accuse or Caught these people when be politician red handed. Why would they do that? This they say no, not be we, not the other people. No, now why you? They won't make. They won't. They won't shame us. They won't shame us. Now then they do the thing. They won't shame us. So they continue pointing hand every now and then. So it's a problem for Nigerian people to handle. It's a big problem because. Another news again one come from Imo State. This one as Sahara reporters. Hand over cops of Imo residents you kill to their families for burial. IPO be ten Nigerian army. Then IPO be now a Nigerian army. Still in the Imo State, right? Remember this particular news when we when we go through right now concerning the hopes of them. They don't already they point and say now they. Uh, indigenous people of Biafra, and then they, you know, spread the video everywhere. Okay, so let me take a look on this particular one. They tell the army people, made a hand off the people when they kill, according to the headline from Sahara Reporter, to their families for burial. According to IPOB Publicity Secretary Comrade Emma Powerful in a statement he issued on Saturday. He said the military personnel also allegedly raped and sexually assaulted the female dwellers of Iyeme community. The indigenous people of Biafra IPOB, they don't come and come accuse the operative of Nigerian army 
of unjustifiably invading Ihime community in Mbano local government area of Imo State. According to IPOB Publicity Secretary Com Comrade Emma Powerful in a statement he issued on Saturday, the military personnel also allegedly raped and sexually insulted a female. Comrade Powerful denied the claim by the Nigerian army that some soldiers were attacked by the Eastern Security Network ESN in the community. He therefore urged the army authorities to hand over the bodies of those killed during the invasion to their families for proper burial rather than using false propaganda to cover up their actions. Okay. The statement read, the Nigerian army carried another operation at the Mba branch in Iyeme, Mba Noluka government area of Imo State as a smoke screen to invade peaceful communities in Iyeme, Mba no. Some rapists among them stationed at Iyeme, Mba Noluka government headquarters have been harassing community women. These soldiers have raped some innocent girls inside the military camp in the local government headquarters. The soldiers were also harassing and forcing themselves on married women who resisted them. When the women resisted their sexual harassment and intimidation, the soldiers mobilized and gave false alarm to 82 Division that ESN operative attacked them. Quickly, the trigger happy 82 Division mobilized terrorist soldiers to invade the people's community. So, ladies and gentlemen, no, I don't hear this one uh, about. Uh, the emo state people again. All these things they happen in emo state. Who puts them mad? They do his own. Hmm? They connect pipeline when he want take sell crude. Hmm? When he want take sell crude, go America and go other part of Europe according to the news. And uh, this one now, now about the people on uniform. When did they tell us what did they do in? Uh, We are from land. This is serious. All this kind of uh, harassment we are hearing from the IPOB sometimes. We don't hear it from the northern part of Nigeria how uh, some people in uniform will be raping people and destroying people and killing people, even seizing their corpse after their death. Uh, this is strange. All this kind of news coming from Biafran land. We don't hear it from uh, we don't hear the same from uh, from the northern part of Nigeria and that worries me too much sometimes. So ladies and gentlemen, I hear we'll stop this uh, particular program. Thank you all and don't forget to subscribe. Bye.